Hey guys, welcome back to Prong Viking. I'm giving you guys the review of my thoughts on after using the 50 pound weeder adjustable dumbbells. They're 50 pound pairs each and um, it comes with a rack. I'll show you guys, but this is how it looks. All right guys, so that's uh, the weeder 50 pound adjustable dumbbell right here. And I'm telling you guys, I love it, man. I love it that we could go from 50 pound, that we could go from 10 pound to 50 pound within like seconds. So basically guys, you pin, you popped it up, and then you lift it out. So you got 10 pounds. So you guys could see, um, it could sit. It's flat, so it could sit. It sits right on your knee, your legs, uh, and it doesn't hurt or anything. And then you see, you could shake it around; it doesn't fall or anything like that. So, so that's pretty cool. And then it, it goes right back in, and then anything you want, you know, 20 pound, bang, quick time. So within seconds, guys, within seconds, you could just swap from uh, 10 pounds to 50 pounds. So that's what I love about it. Um, check the link in the description box. I have it, guys. Um, you could check it out. The reviews, more details in the link in the description box below. And I'm telling you so far, I did chest, shoulder, back. I did almost everything pretty much on these with these guys because I was super excited. And I love it for the budget price. Uh, you can't go wrong. There's some of them goes up to like five, six hundred bucks. I'm pretty sure this um, this is probably I can't even remember how much I paid, but I'm pretty sure it's around like three hundred bucks or under. I gotta double check. I'll leave as I said. I'll leave all the link in the description so you guys could go ahead and check it out. Uh, overall, real quick review on the Weeder 50 pound guys. I'm telling you, I love it so far. I tried it up for a couple of days. I did a lot of um, exercise. I did uh, you know arms, chest. And I also did some shoulder with it, and I love it. It's easy to swap, and, you know, it's worth it. You know, to some people who never have one before will ask, you know, is it worth it? Is it a big difference? And absolutely. If you don't have space, these guys are perfect. If you, you know, you don't have a lot of time in your hand that you have to swap dumbbells all the time, these guys are great. And then it's cheaper. It's really cheaper because if you have to go buy every single pair of dumbbell between 10 to 50 pounds, you're paying a lot more then you're gonna pay for this so it's cheaper it's easier and it's you know it's fast if you're doing drop set super set it's easy to swap the way it's high to low and so far guys this weeder one um is the first adjustable dumbbell i had i had all old school dumbbells so this was the first pair i got and so far i'm telling you i love it guys um it's awesome and the price as i said is better because i see some other adjustable i was looking to buy but they're, they're kind of pricey some of them get up like five six hundred bucks and i wasn't gonna pay five six hundred bucks so when i found these guys um it was a big you know it was a you know right away sale any question or anything just leave in the comment below i always love to get to your questions and um if you guys are about to buy one or you're now having one you know Leave a comment. Let us know what you think about it. And don't forget, guys, if you if you subscribe to my channel and you click on the bell icon, it's 100% free. And every time I upload a video, you guys will get a notification that hey, Bronk Viking upload a video. And guys, remember one thing, guys. When you lift in weight, always remember 10 pounds to 50 pounds. That's a lot of weights already there. You don't need a lot of weight. And remember, slow and steady wins the race. Always remember, guys, it's not how much rep or how much weight you're lifting. You know, it's always about the the perfect way the form the right form you make sure you get the right form you're feeling the contraction like simple exercise i'll show you guys real quick like if you're going to do a bicep when you come up make sure your arm is not moving just your your forearm coming out like this and you're curling squeeze that contraction come down and you squeeze it always hold back the weight guys always hold back the weight the negative is very important guys and then you squeeze that and then you come right back down. I see a lot of people are jucking and doing a lot of stuff, but you wanna make sure you stay focused on the muscle that you're doing, you understand? And most people will drop it, you know, eight set, 10 set. Right now, guys, I do sometimes until I'm burned. And if you're doing 20, 30 reps, means the weight is too light. Increase your weight so you'll get a better pump and you'll get a better um, result, guys. <laughs> 